<laughs> so here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do week 17's picks. Man, it's hard to believe we're almost at the end of the season that quick. Yeah, one week like after this start, week, one more, huh? One more week after this. One week, man. We almost to the postseason. Uh, uh, what's the name? Yeah, it's so the postseason. So first up, Thursday, December 29th. Amazon Prime, if you got Prime, because I sure don't got it. But hey, <laughs> to those who do, the Cowboys play the Titans in Tennessee. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this game right here, I ain't gonna watch it, but I know <laughs> right now, this game right here is a pickle. I can't believe I did. I mean, yeah, that's the problem. Here's the it thing. should be the Cowboys with ease. It should be, but what did we just say a week ago <laughs> about the Cowboys? There's they showed up last week. Yeah. Are they gonna show up uh, this week? And what's his name? Questionable. He got, you know, that, that's one of those quarterbacks that get the whole media talking about, oh, he got the 40 burger on them. Oh, no. He got, one one, he got Michael Irvin talking about 40 burger. Then the, ne- then the next week was like, oh, Dak is Dak. You know, two quarters in, two quarters out. You know? This sh- <laughs> I, I don't I'm even a- want to make a pick for this one. I'm be honest. I don't. I don't. Give me, I'll go with the Cowboys because I have no faith in, in Malik Willis. I'll pick the Cowboys. Unless Derrick Henry become Derrick Henry that we know, which he's having a Derrick Henry year. But uh, Malik Willis, bro, uh, I'm not liking what I'm seeing. I feel you. He ain't ready. That's yet. the only reason I'm going to Cowboys. That's the only reason. And you have a valid point. The I'm not surprised. On paper, the Cowboys should win. I, I might head you. Yeah, I would too. I'm taking a plus 10. They're not winning by 10. It's a Thursday night game, so I might not even touch it. I might. Yeah, I might not either. I, I might, might only do it because I get you gonna get something because the Cowboys. They are gonna have some big money out there because the Cowboys. I just don't trust it. But You're right. And, and, and we'll, we'll move on. Well, I, I, for now, for the sake of the pick, I'll throw the Cowboys in there. I just feel like man, they're gonna make <laughs> they're they gonna mess it up. They're gonna mess around and lose, and Malik mm-hmm. Willis is gonna be the hero. Watch. But you ain't here for me though. So right. first up Sunday. January 1st, New Year's Day. New Year's Day. Cardinals, Falcons, Atlanta. Wait, Cardinals and Falcons? Yes. Uh, I could really care less. Yeah, at this point, because Kyler's yeah. out and Falcons don't have a quarterback. So just, it's, it's a low-scoring pick em. Yeah, I could really care less. I'm not touching that game. Yeah, I refuse to put anything money I'm on that game. I'm not touching that game. If I put your money, it's on D-Hop. That's what it. You call, what you call it? It's a trap game. Yeah, I could really care less. I'm not touching it. Yeah, I could care less. Yeah, I mean, if you want to pick one for the sake of picks, ladies and gentlemen, I mean, you can go with the Cardinals, but don't be surprised the Falcons upset you. I'm not touching yeah, it. I don't think you exactly. There's no starting quarterbacks in this. I mean, you got D-Hop on one side. You got – is Kyle, Kyle Pitts is out, ain't he? Yeah, Kyle Pitts is out. That's they it. Don't, they don't got nobody. Cordell Patterson. That's it. <laughs> and you put a Cordell against D-Hop? That's not even fair. These not, uh, I could care less. It don't matter. Let's move on. We're, we're, give, we're giving teams that are irrelevant too much time. That's true. Dolphins, Patriots. After what just happened in, with Green Bay, I'm going with the Dolphins because that was some BS. Y'all shouldn't have lost that game. Now, it could be a, a part two. To what I'm, happened think, this I'm thinking of the Patriots. When they start winning, but then they mess around. And well, you know, your boy out. Who out? Tua. He in concussion protocol, so they don't know if he's gonna be ready. So it's Teddy B. Again. Again. Yeah. He played through the game he wasn't supposed to play. So they said there's a they said there's a uh 50-50 shot if he play or not. Oh man. Right, yeah, well, if, okay. If two is out, I'll, I'll have to pick New England. It is in Foxborough and it's the beginning of the year. It's gonna be super cold. So and Teddy, exactly. I love Teddy, but uh, yeah, Teddy, but that's your man. Yeah, that's my man. Uh, we'll we'll rock we'll rock with that. It depends on the, the health condition. If two, if two is healthy, I'm gonna rock with Dolphins. But if if two don't play, Mac Daddy got to win it for the Patriots, man. Right. Up next, we got Saints and Eagles. Listen to me, Philly. Don't you don't you do it at home. We better not lose at home. You better not lose to the Red Rifle at home. Right. This close, this end of the season, we're just gonna start throwing, giving games out for free. Christmas mm-hmm. ended already. Christmas was a week ago, right? We it's the new year, free. right? It'd be a new year. Don't you do that? New year, don't so, you do that? As of now, he's questionable. Hurts. Hurts is today. He's questionable. 
you gonna play? I don't think it really matters. I mean, technically, Garner Minshew could hold his own against Andy Dalton. That's why I said I don't think it really matters who I got. It's not that. It's a very small gap margin of error between Red Rifle yeah. and Garner Minshew. It's like yeah, they're not that different at this stage in I'm, Andy Dalton's career. Really, I don't really care who the quarterback is in this game for the Philly. They about the same. I'm gonna go with. I was go with Philly. We rock with Philly though. Philly, Philly should win it. If they don't, we gonna have. A, I'm gonna have to have a whole rant next week. Mm-hmm. This next one, Giants. Y'all saw what happened to the Colts against Chargers. All right, y'all saw that, right? Y'all watch that game. Watch the tape. Oh, Colts and Giants. <laughs> yeah, watch the tape. Watch the tape. They, they they don't care about this season. This season is a, they're tanking for a quarterback. Clearly, it's over. Forget about it. Sam Andrews gonna be the quarterback. What? It's not. It's not. I'm. I'm just saying that it's not gonna be not what Nick Foles just put up. Why are, we, why are we doing this to ourselves? Is Sam Ellinger or Matt Ryan? One of the two of them about to start. Why are we doing this to ourselves? Nick Foles, you know it's so bad? Nick Foles looks so bad this week. I had to do a double take. I thought it was Matt Ryan. <laughs> That's sad. He looked like Matt Ryan out there. I know. Matt Ryan was on the sideline with a headset on. Now it's going to be Matt Ryan and Nick Foles out there with a headset on. Both coaches, Sam Ellinger. Right. Simultaneously. Yeah. Let's move on. Panthers, Buccaneers. I think we know the answer to this question. Never bet against the GOAT. That's a quote. Never bet against the GOAT. Turner not going to like that, but, yeah, I'll go with, Pan- I'll go with Tampa Bay. Turner, it's nothing personal, dog. Nothing personal. <laughs> Sam Darnold is respectable right now based on what he just did. Mm-hmm. Talk me some money against but, the Lions. But Tom Brady. Tom Brady's the GOAT. And you hey, it's, um, it's clutch Tom Brady. It's clutch Tom now. Don't be it, going to play. You ain't that. Dane, but. It's clutch. You know what it's me. Hey, you trying to get to the playoffs, ain't you? And you trying to get another Super Bowl before you retire? They win, they in the playoffs. If they win, they got the division. You got to get one more. You got you got to give me one more. All yes, right, sir. So this next game is a blow. Oh my lord! After what? After what just happened to the Broncos? Who they play? Oh yeah, <laughs> you are. Oh, I'm pitching uh, Russell Wilson. It's gonna be ripening. Yeah, uh, whatever his name is. Yeah, Brett Riper, is that his name? I think so. Yeah, golly, Russell Wilson numbers are atrocious. Yeah, we're not talking about that. We just gonna compare the Patrick Mahomes season. Oh god, we just gonna move on. We 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 know the answer to this question, Tom. There's no debate, no discussion. <laughs> All right, Bears and Lions. Now this is a pick. I'm gonna tell you why. The Lions should win this based on their offensive presence, yeah, but, but their defense is so <laughs> trash. I think Justin Fields might Justin have a coming Justin out part. Justin Fields win this game by himself, honestly. Yeah. I think Justin Fields is going to throw for 200 yards and rush for two touchdowns. So, You going with the Bears? Yeah. Oh, Lord help them. I was oh. on the Lions train, but they lost last week. No football. They lost who? No, the Lions lost last week. They was hot. Now they're coming back down to earth. So you now crazy. Justin Fields is like. But the, it, it, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. Looking at Jared Goff's numbers, he didn't come back down to earth. What, what, I, I no, no the, team did. the team did. They lost. What but, happened yeah. was they were playing teams that didn't know how to run on the defense. Yeah. Then they started playing some top-tier teams that knew how to run through their right. defense and got exposed. Last week was an exposure. The Panthers are not a good team. Sorry, sorry Turner, don't take this part. I know, that's, I know you're a homer. If they win, though, they in the playoffs. If who wins? Panthers. This week? Yeah. Oh, oh, who they play? If they play Temple Bay, if they beat Temple Bay, that ain't gonna they, happen. That ain't I gonna know. Happen. Brady, no. How did, now Brady been in this game twenty years? Mm-hmm. You think Brady always, don't know? You think Brady don't look at standings? You think he don't look at home. rankings? Yeah, at home too. You think he don't know that? He like, oh, so I'm gonna let a, a a division rival get to the playoffs and put my my playoff mm-hmm. picture in question? I don't think so. Right. I don't think so. Oh, I, I don't believe, care. I, I, agree. I don't care if my center is a rookie. I don't care if my <laughs> left and right tackle yeah. is young. I don't care if my receivers is banged up. We're gonna find a way to win this game. Mm-hmm. It's gonna oh, be I an agree. ugly game. It's gonna be ugly. I don't mm-hmm. expect Brady to have a, a stellar game just because yeah, it's a year. So why we have stellar game? <laughs> <laughs> I don't expect. No, but I, I I knew that because Turner told me that a couple weeks ago. What's that? He said, "If the Panthers beat the Bucks, the Panthers have the uh, they got the win." Yeah. yeah, but I don't see that happening. No, 
no, no, no, no. That's <laughs> wishful thinking on Turner's part. Yeah, exactly. He forgot his quarterback is Sam Darnold. <laughs> and he lost Baker, and Baker's showing his ass right, in L.A. So right now. Right. He what forgot about that. Now, if he still had Baker Walker. Mayfield on the bench or oh, P.J. Just, Walker, I'm sorry, yeah. Phillip Walker. Now they call him Phillip now. Right. Phillip, if you had Phillip and Baker backing up Darnold, then I would add, I would honestly, and I don't bet against the go off. I you, you think about it. I would strongly think about hedging the right. bet. But yeah, I wouldn't I'm bet gonna, against Brady, but I'd bet with him yeah, as well as against I, him. Yeah, but I got a good feeling the Bears going to win, though, going back to what the Lions. I got a good feeling. Yeah, it, well, with the Lions' lack of defense, they should. The Lions should win it, but I got On paper, the Lions are better offensive. They have more weapons, but they don't have no defense. Their defense they got is, 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 is uh, lackluster at best. Mm-hmm. And that's no disrespect to Dan Campbell. That's not a coaching error. That's just a, a personnel error. It's just a fact. <laughs> Your team needs to upgrade the defense. Absolutely. I so this all season shouldn't even be about offense. Don't even don't even look right. at re- when you go back to the draft next season. Don't look at receivers. Don't look at mm-hmm. running backs. Don't look at tight ends. Don't look at slots. You need all Defense. defensive linemen you can get. I give you offensive line. That's right. <laughs> uh, free safety. Y'all need all of that. Uh, whole, yeah. The whole all the money y'all have at Ford Field needs to go to your defense next season. They do have new stadium coming. Congratulations. Congrats to that. Ain't they moving to Ann Arbor? Yeah, they moving. Yeah, yeah. They need that. That's they've been there forever. Okay, I heard about yeah, they, that. It's been like that. Congrats to that, yo. That's dope. That's yeah. dope. Uh, this next game is a game I don't care about, but I'm gonna I'm gonna talk on it for a brief second. It's the Browns going against the Commanders. Yeah, we I all really know agree. this is a lost year for Deshaun. It's just him getting his feet wet, getting getting back in the groove. So I don't have no uh, expectations for Deshaun Watson this season. Yeah, I don't either. I really don't for Washington in this game either, to be honest. Washington should win this game. They should is the key word. Do I want to? Not really. Yeah. Because then that puts Carson Wentz in a position to go to the playoffs. I don't want him in the playoffs. Yeah, I could really care less, to be I honest. I care less about it, but I don't want Carson Wentz to go. Yeah. Right, so you're going to go to the Browns. <laughs> I hope the Browns find a way. You, Kareem Hunt, Nick Chubb, <laughs> run that Make damn sure. ball. Right, Deshaun time. Watson, you run too. Whatever you, you gotta do, you run to you, you. You a mobile, you a dual threat. You yeah, run to. Exactly. Y'all ain't gotta throw nothing. Y'all ain't got nobody. To throw. Who you gonna throw to? Who you gonna throw right. to? You gonna put Nick <laughs> Chubb? You gonna put Nick Chubb on a wide out? Right. Hell no, you're not gonna do that. He's a running back. He wants the ball in in, in the bread basket. Mm-hmm. Tuck it and run. That's what he <laughs> wants. We go with. I go with the Browns too. Run. I could really care less, but I go with the Browns. Yeah, Browns can win it. I'm. I, I would not be mad about it. Mm. It ain't going to do nothing because Browns ain't going away this year and the Commanders need to go to the playoffs. They're first-round knockout. Exactly. Who are they going to go up against first round? <laughs> it, it don't, does it matter? No, it does it don't. not. Because Ron Rivera is on his way out the door anyway. Yeah, he better get fired. I'm sorry. Mutual <laughs> agreement. They'll call it a mutual agreement. We already know yeah. what that means. Make it look safe face, yeah. So, now, this next game, I would pick the Jaguars for the sake of I want them to win the division just to, like, Shove it in everybody's face that doubted them this year. They lost some games they should have won, as you mentioned earlier in the, in the previous segment. Absolutely. I'm going with Jacksonville. With the Jaguars, correct me if I'm wrong. The Jaguars remind me of the Vikings last year. Yeah. They really should have won, which I kind of choked them in the corner. Yeah. Yeah. They really remind me of the team last year. They're, they're, they're like there, but they're like a few pieces of what. Yeah, yeah. I, they buried in Houston though. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. Houston and Cook, so I don't, I don't, I don't see them winning that game. Yeah, I'm going Jackson. Now Texas is gonna make it interesting because it's at yeah, home. It's a divisional game too. Yeah, it's the Jaguars. Yeah, we're gonna make it interesting. 